So I go by Target today and I see this. Modern Horizons 2 collector packs on sale for $11.99. So naturally I load all of them into my cart and go to the checkout. And they're like, sir, you can't buy all of those. It's unfair to the other guests. And uh, once I was done screaming uh, and yelling in the middle of the store, they finally relented and said fine. So then I scanned it and it ended up actually being a misprice. And of course, they're at $39.99 like they should be. And since I'm kidding, I would never throw a fit in the middle of Target. Not that bad. Uh, I go and put them back and instead end up with this bundle of Modern Horizons 2 regular draft boosters. Um, I always uh, like to get a fat pack of every um, set that comes out. I already opened it a second ago and I lost the audio, so I'm doing it again. Um, like the box, very cool. Um, I'm kind of interested in collecting these and opening up the, uh, the whole kind of poster deal here. And uh, see what's in there, we got Dak on. Uh, very cool. Um, sketchy art there that's really cool so um, got a nice little squirrels of the multiverse um, uh, inserts were actually kind of fun um, I'll take that got a little bit of welcome or whatever there and then there's always this box here which is utterly useless I think I do have a use for it let me uh, yeah I think I finally figured it out this is to take your snacks to uh, Friday Night Magic with, right? There you go, just fill that up with your favorite snack. Uh, mine happens to be um, whatever was in the pantry for my kids. Uh, there you go, it's like a rhinoceros. Perfect, then you never go hungry. Since you can't fit cards, and it's way too much for dice and tokens and stuff, it's obviously for snacks. So, there you go. That's what that's all about. All right, let's get on to the cards. 10 packs, MH2, and uh, let's see. Got a Usury Fortune's Flame promo. Um, I like the little half box too, actually. And uh, this is actually the big winner of the box is the, the extra large spin down uh, with the logo on it. This one's like really cool colors. Um, that's Keeper. All right, and let's see, I think in here are some foil basic lands. And then a pack of regular basic lands. There we go, and these are like some kind of cool old school uh, art that hasn't been printed in a while. Stuff from Mirage, uh, stuff from Odyssey, maybe Onslaught, stuff like that. So, super cool. Those will be handy at some point. Here we go. He's in and uh, definitely need to try to break even on my box here. So I'm going to put up the old scanner and see if I can break 85 bucks here. I feel like the it's a tall order. Um, <clears throat> you don't have all the extra chances at like cool uh, uh, alternate borders and stuff like that. So let's see how we do. Gargadon. Got uh, some uncommons. Infiltrator Capricrome, the Underworld Cookbook. Patchwork. No, so we actually get four uncommons. And there's a rare dress down. And a foil Storm God's Oracle. And a cool beast token. All right, dress down is. Not the full version. Hang on. There we go. Now we're actually set up. So 250 there. Got a long way to go. Oh, I'm sorry. 99 cents. <laughs> An even further way to go. All right, I'm going to have to hit something real big here. Probably to get uh, the worth out of there. Looking for the so shiny. Captured by Legax. That's pretty bad. Some of the uncommons in this set um, are worth a bit. I don't think this is one of them. Uh, Power Depot, Road to Ruin. 
Batterbone, Zirin Orb, and Urza Saga, the sketch version. Well, that goes a long way towards our uh, goal there. Uh, this one's pretty decent. 31, 25. All right. Now there's hope for this now. All right. Oh, I can go right there. Next up. I need like two more hits like that. We're in business here. Zealot. Kitchen Imp. Uh, I think even a lot of commons in here are um, going to see some play in uh, modern popper for sure. Ripley Vance, Underworld Hermit, Abiding Grace, Greed, Entering Modern, Gaia's Will, Suspend, and you can play Lance from your graveyard. That's okay. It's a buck fifty-five. Next. The Lash Claw. Garganon. Sketch cards? Alright, I'm into the sketch cards, I gotta say. Violent Tumor. I'm into the alternate uh, old border stuff, too. Violent Tumor. Flame Blitz. Timeless Witness. This is a uncommon that I'm gonna scan. We got a Cursed Totem. It's a buck. Cursed Totem. It's like a pithing needle on an artifact, right? Or... I think Needle is one particular card. Anyway, Magus of the Bridge. Babink, nothing big there. And a Gargoyle. All right. All right. Need a big fetch land, probably, to get this done. I pulled two uh, um, showcase, I'm sorry, box topper style um, Cabal Coffers out of my uh, collector's boxes, so. Got that going for me. Got Chatterstorm, Brainstone, Mystic Redaction, Feast of Sanity, Counterspell, and Karth the Lion. Counterspell, three bucks. Um, it saw the wrong version. Hold on. Um, and it doesn't want to find the right version, so it's probably not three bucks. More like one buck. Karth the Lion. He's a one bucker as well. Almost halfway there. Unholy heat. Initiate. Turex Canticle. Man, that thing's pretty cool looking art there. Healer's Flock. Flay Essence. Arcbound Shikari. Creon Ranger. I'm going to scan this one. And a Soul Talisman. Wow. 76 cents. That's a keeper for me suspend three and get a soul ring after that 218 too slow for oops it's a it's the budget soul ring it's when your mom says we have soul ring at home urban dagger teeth oops get on there late to dinner never Dray Keeper. Squirrel Sovereign. The Earl of Squirrel approves. Squirrel Lord. Ghostlit Drifter. Slag Strider. Chainer. Nightmare Adept. Previously printed in Commander Ray. And a Sanctum Weaver. 43 cents. Five bucks there. All right. And will we make it to 85? Zealot, Starfish, Glimmer Baron is a cute card. It's fun. Arcbound Whelp, Vectus Gloves, Clattering Augur, Soul Snare. Ooh, got a Mythic Endurance Elemental Incarnation, which uh, oh yeah, this one with the great the Evoke cost to just exile a green card. That's Force of Endurance, right? 21. All right. Now we're there. And patchwork gnomes. All right. Need like one more decent thing to finish this off. You can smell the fear right here. I saw something legendary at the back. Salvaging. 
sketch blossoming calm. Said and done. Spreading insurrection. Milliken. Necrogoif. Ooh, I got a foil. Piru, the volatile. Necrogoif is nothing big. Piru. Oops. 67 cents and the foil is probably not much more. 268. All right, one more chance here. Need 10 bucks. Can it be done? Coming down to the wire. Crack open this pack and get something epic. Ravaging Visionary. Ether Sworn Sphinx. Break the ice. Braids. That's not going to do it. One more. Verdant Catacomb. That did it. Oh my gosh. Oh man. Cackling along with Braids there. Uh, that's great. Okay. Braids is like a buck or less now. Um, Verdant Catacombs. I got a fetchy. Is 40 bucks. Hey. The luck of the tragic strikes again. There we go. Some a couple, three good ones there. Anyway, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. Uh, Tragic MTG. Like and subscribe. Catch you later. Don't throw a fit at Target. Just saying.